The future of memory in times of smartphones, uh, different cultural exchanges. Uh, what does it mean to be a painter in the 21st century? All those are questions, subjects, that we can find in the work of young Thai artist Korakrit Arora Nonchai, which has his first solo show in Italy here at Museion. Our visitors will be in a kind of overwhelming atmosphere uh, made by installations, films, paintings and also kind of props that come from the films of the artist. In those films, the artist himself, but also his double, the denim painter, faces on the one hand uh, the spirituality of the oriental tradition and on the other hand the tradition of western painting. So we can find footage with Jackson Pollock, Yves Klein, but uh, the viewer will see that all this footage is without quotation. So for the artist, it's pretty normal to dig in the World Wide Web and to pick what he likes. So um, it's really a new kind of art, a kind of amazing art, where we can find not only answers, but only questions. Where will our memory go in times of the smartphone, but also where will the art go? This exhibition is called Painting with History 3 or <clears throat> 2,559 years to figure stuff out. One of the first idea was to, you know, try to work with this, this like a very special like architectural characteristic of this building, or particularly this floor, which is the full wall window on the east and the west. Uh, the east facing the Italian side and the west facing the German speaking side. And I guess that there's an interesting geographical location where in this room is almost like the two sides pass through it together and meet in the middle. The working in uh, the top floor museum, um, the room has a very distinctive uh, quality of light that's from the two big windows on the east and the west side. I wanted to somehow find a way that the light coming in would play a very like important part in the visuality and, and the entire feeling of the room. And so there's um, their color gels in three uh, the primary colors put in. One, the yellow on the, the ceiling. On the west side is blue and on the east side is red. And it's a sort of, um, I think the gels, first of all, they completely alter the objects in the room based on the time of the day or how it is outside. But also there's a kind of altered vision of the view that we get from looking outside as well. When you're looking in different parts of the room, it almost has this, the shift in the color has a very physicalness. 